Well, I just want to point out that a stock or two stocks that I'm watching in today's trading session is Glenmark Pharma as well as Glenmark Life. Now, why is that? Is because Nirma has completed the acquisition of that 75% stake in Glenmark Life, which used to be the API arm of Glenmark. Now, remember that Glenmark divested 75% of this API business, Glenmark Life, to Nirma for around 5,651 crores in September 2023. Now, Nirma, remember, has entered into the pharma space in 2005. So it's been quite a uh, old player there. They entered via the acquisition of an ailing injectable business. So they are apparently going to use this platform to expand their position in the pharma space. Now, Glenmark is in focus. Now, remember that stock has run up around 130% from its 52-week low. So maybe uh, the gains are capped to a certain extent as well. But uh, Glenmark is going to continue owning 7.83% in Glenmark Life Sciences. It will be reclassified as a public shareholder. They are going to be receiving 5,600 crores from the stake sale in Glenmark Life Sciences. And the most important is that Glenmark is going to become net cash positive post this deal. They will be pairing off debt. Remember, gross debt stood at around 4,953 crores as of December 31st. Net debt at around 3,523 crores. And the company will be net cash positive. Earlier guidance included that they should have around 500 crores of cash on their books. But there was no decision in terms of rewarding shareholders. So maybe that will be something to watch out for. Well, we need to take a short break on the, on the back of uh, the fact that it's an extremely weak market. So it's a good time to discuss the technicals. Jay Thakkar will be joining in with his strategies next. Stay tuned.